Hey there, Matt here, and I wanted to show you our supersize food trailer. Now, previously we had a rounded front on the supersize food trailer, and people were asking, hey, can you just make a square? So we've made it the rectangle like the rest of our trailer, right? So I want to take you through a walkthrough of the entire trailer. I'm just, you'll see our factory just up here, okay? So we've gone down the road um, into the shade. We can hear some birds chirping in the tree up there, and um, we're good to go, right? So um, we'll start at the front go underneath, work backwards and go inside the trailer, okay? So first and foremost, okay, um, being the size of this trailer, it has a GVM of 2,600 kilos, okay? Heavy duty tow chains. Once you go over 1,990 kilos, you need to have electric brakes. So there's got four wheel electric brakes on there, right? Uh, it's got your um, breakaway system here. Um, that's your little part that breaks off if, if you somehow the trailer comes off. Jockey wheel, okay, uh, twin gas system. Um, the gas system is designed 18 kilo bottle, 9 kilo bottle. Take the drawbar off, 45 kilo bottle, right? Now, not very many people take the drawbar off, but 18 kilo bottles if you want to use them, okay? Um, I'll go inside the trailer, inside the actual trailer in a minute, right? All full engineered chassis, okay? Um, it seeds Australian standards, doesn't just meet it, it seeds Australian standards, right? Um, along here, checker plate sides, right? Um, we make it super strong. We use these big, massive rivets and then um, really tighten the thing right up, okay? Um, underneath the trailer, okay? I'll get in underneath here. And essentially, you can see galvanized chassis, your water tank, so you've got a gray and freshwater water tank, drop down legs. So when you're on site, you can literally drop down and, and um, you can literally drop down and um, um, secure the trailer and level it up. This size trailer, you probably, in many ways you don't need them because the trailer is too heavy, you can't stand in the back and flip it up, okay? Vents for the refrigeration that we put along the front, okay? To make sure everything works properly. Sticking our head in underneath here, okay? Sticking our head in underneath here, you'll see the other water tank, okay? Obviously axles, springs, four wheel brakes, and so on and so forth, right? So that's the outside of the trailer. Now, a lot of people don't understand this, okay? And I haven't really pointed out in other videos, but I want to take time to point out, there's a few things that all our trailers XL and up have, okay? Um, well, yeah, most of our XL and up have is, this is not crappy cold room panel, right? This is one piece fiberglass panel. So it's fiberglass, platinum core insulation, then fiberglass on the other side. It makes it heaps durable, heaps more durable and heaps more user friendly. So dirt and stuff just wipes off. Color bond and cool room panel, you probably notice you can just go like that and bang, dented straight away. So to avoid that happening, right, what we basically do is um, is um, have that paneling. So I'm just going to jump in here. So hopefully a little bit less windy. I've just seemed to cop a lot of wind there. So hopefully it's not too bad um, with the wind. Anyhow, going through the inside of the trailer, if we start from this end and work backwards, okay, um, your deep fryer. This is basically a standard super size less it doesn't have the food warmer in it okay so normally you have a food warmer in it this particular client is a client's trailer not far off ready to go um they've actually just maneuvered things around which we can do some people say um can we maneuver something yeah no worries we do that as part of the process once you come through and pay your deposits one of my guys he'll um deal with you on the way through and um, um essentially modify whatever you need to modify so um your gas deep fryer okay easy to empty out you would have seen in a couple of other videos okay um, your chip warmer, okay, um, your um, 750mm wide gas grill, if you want a char grill, um, grill, we can do that with a 600mm wide. Normally, the four burner cooktop would actually be up here, okay, towards the sinks, but this particular client uh, asked to put it down here, so we need an extra bench, brought the bench up. Cold Bay Marie, okay, hot Bay Marie. Then you can sort of be, if you want to close one window off and be in this area cooking, you essentially have this window open, have ventilation, have that window serving, have this one to open up more area for you, okay? Um, oven, pizza oven here, freezer, okay? Um, another thing that people don't realize is we have all our trailers with cabinetry. So first, we use high grade 304 stainless steel, then everything's got cabinetry. Um, you find a lot of other trailers exist and all they've got is a bench and then a big open gap underneath and crappy old vinyl floor and crappy old cool room panel, okay? Um, so you want to make sure you know what you're buying, okay? Um, freezer, hot bay marie, okay? Cash drawer, okay? Um, then you've got your um, fridge and then another fridge. So heaps of refrigeration. When you jump up from the Maxi Elite to um, the uh, Super Size, you're basically jumping up 10 grand, right? electric brakes, chassis, 
gets bigger. You get another fridge, you get extra bits and pieces, okay? So that's part of the reason why the price jumps up, but so much more room when you're working away and so on and so forth. So um, if you want one of these, and we've obviously got the cold bay marie, the sinks and so on, so everything you see here is basically how it comes, okay? Um, there's finance, the finance terms are below. You gotta go ahead and contact us, call us on our 1300 number, drop us an email, offers at foodtrailerking.com.au or fill in the form at foodtrailerking.com.au forward slash step three. Delivery Australia wide, no problems whatsoever. We can put in direct contact um, with a person that can help with finance. If you want finance, you need to be working, okay? You need to have an income, otherwise you won't get the finance. Even if you've got heaps of assets, you need to have an income. That's the first thing they look at, okay? Um, then we go through, build your trailer. If you want to shuffle some things around, we can do that for you. Just a matter of having a conversation. So uh, go ahead, contact us in regards to that. And then, um, yeah, hopefully we'll be talking soon. Get you sorted out with your own supersized food trailer.